Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today I am back with another declutter video and this one is very special. So I wore my very special princess dress to celebrate this occasion. I am decluttering my dresses. <laughs> so this has been a long time coming. This has been by far the most requested declutter. Everyone wants to see my dress collection and there are quite a lot of dresses to see. So <laughs> um, grab some tea, maybe a cozy blanket, <laughs> and uh, yeah, because this is going to be a really, really long one, I might have to break it up into two parts. I'm not really sure yet, so we'll see. But this is going to be a long one, so I'm going to try not to talk too much. But so far, I have decluttered my shoes, my handbags, and my jewelry, and most recently, my coats. So if you want to see my coat collection declutter, you can check that out right here. I've got lots of really pretty, colorful, feminine coats um, that I think you all would love. And as for all of my accessory declutters, my shoes, handbags, and jewelry, I will leave links to all of those below so that you can check those out because I think you would really love them, especially if you love declutter videos or if you just want to see my massive collections of everything. <laughs> so before I get into it, I do want to make a little disclaimer and I have done this in all of my videos. Firstly, I am a full-time blogger, influencer, and now YouTuber, and I've been doing this for eight years. So a lot has accumulated since then and I was quite the clothing hoarder before then. I've always been a dress lover, definitely dresses over anything else. I think I have like two pairs of jeans that I never wear. <laughs> but I really, really, really love dresses. Yeah, so I have a lot and I have always had a lot and I have accumulated even more over the years. So as you can imagine, my closet is overflowing. Literally, there is no more space. So I absolutely have to do this declutter. And I never want anyone to feel bad about it. I don't want you to feel bad about yourself um, for seeing how excessive my wardrobe is because it really is and it really is embarrassing. Um, I'm not a minimalist in any sense of the word. I love to have a lot of choices and I really, really love dresses. So um, you definitely don't have to have a closet full of clothing to this extent like I do in order to feel happy or worthy or valuable in any way and I just want you to know that um, it's not my intention to make anyone feel bad at all I'm just simply sharing my clothing and um, the process of decluttering because I already know that I have too much and I'm definitely trying to pare down my life and my closet and everything else so um, thank you for joining me in this journey and I love you all so much and I'm really happy to share all of this with you. So you're probably wondering what do I do with all of the clothing that I'm getting rid of. I do a lot of things. I donate quite a bit. I also can sign and sell on Poshmark and give away. For Poshmark I will leave the link in the description if you want to check out my shop and um, potentially shop my wardrobe. But yeah let's go ahead and get into my dress declutter because this is going to be a long one. So here is the master where all of my clothes are. There's so many. <laughs> it's kind of a disaster right now. So yeah, please forgive me. I'm going to clean it up a little bit and organize it. So over here, I have all of my long dresses. And then over here, I've got like sleeveless dresses, short sleeve and long sleeve, but they're all shorter. Oh, and these are tops. <laughs> so I don't think we're going to get to that today. But yeah, so this section and this section. And right here, I have all of my favorite dresses. So I will start with these. I do have more in storage in the garage. Um, some of them are seasonal and some of them I am already planning to get rid of, so I'll show you those as well. All right, so I'm going to start with all of my favorite dresses. Um, I'll start on this side so that I can go in order of color. <laughs> and the dress that I'm wearing is actually an older one from Sister Jane. 
yes, I will be keeping it. Um, but yeah, okay, let's get started. I absolutely love this one. It's from Vita Grace and it's super flowy and twirly and it has these really cute like little polka dot things on it but it's a really cute dress definitely keeping this one to be honest I'm probably going to keep a lot of the dresses that are on this uh, little wardrobe rack just because it is my favorite this one is from red dress and I love it so much I wore it in Puerto Vallarta and it was absolutely perfect for that this is from chic wish and this is a really nice everyday like maxi dress it does have some eyelet very girly and feminine and has almost like a boho feel. This is also from Vita Grace. I love this dress so much. It's so beautiful. It has this gorgeous embroidery on it, some pearl buttons, and of course a puff sleeve. This is from the Halogen and Atlantic Pacific collab. It's really, really cute. I absolutely adore this dress. Love the little bow details in the front and all the floral embroidery. This is from River Island. It does still have the tag, but I did photograph it last year and I do plan on wearing it more this year. It's really cute. It has polka dots and puff sleeves and these really cute little buttons. The only thing about this one is that it is slightly see-through and I was really disappointed um, that it was for the price, um, but regardless, I do still really like the dress, and it is something that I'll wear. This is another cute dress from Chicwish. I love this one. It's all eyelet. It has a slight puff sleeve and a little um, button-up detail along with a lace collar. This one is also chic wish. It has more of a boho feel and I really love this one in the summertime. Um, I think it's really flowy and airy and just a nice casual dress. This one is from Red Dress and I love it so much but I haven't actually worn this one because when I got it, it was a little bit too small and <laughs> I couldn't return it. So I'm going to try this one on. Um, I do think it'll fit now but yeah, it's really pretty. This one is also chic wish. I adore this dress. It is so so cute. It's very twirly and girly. It has floral embroidery and I really love the length of it. This is an older one from Zara. I think it is really, really pretty. I do want to try this one on because it has been a while since I wore it. This is from Free People and this is actually a Poshmark find and I got it I want to say during the fall, so not that long ago. Um, so I haven't actually worn it yet, but I wanted like a nice everyday dress that was good quality, and this definitely fits that. This is from the Love Shack Fancy and Target collaboration. I adore this dress. It's a great everyday dress. It's really pretty and feminine, and it makes me feel beautiful. This is from Love Shack Fancy, and I got it on major, major sale. I got a deal on this. It is so beautiful. I absolutely love the print, and I love the look of it, and I actually got the, um, the shirt version as well. This one is from Red Dress, and I wore it a ton last year, and I still love it just as much, so I know that I'll definitely be getting a lot of wear out of this one. This was another Poshmark find. I swear I find the best stuff on there. But this is Sister Jane and it's honestly the most beautiful dress I have ever seen. I just love it so much as an open back and a beautiful tiered skirt. It is just divine. This is from Wave, and I don't typically go for light yellow. I just feel like it doesn't always look that great on me, but I absolutely love this dress. It has ruffles all the way down the skirt, and the floral print is just so pretty. So I have two dresses with the same print. <laughs> this first one, actually both of them are from Chic Wish, but this first one is really, really beautiful. It almost looks like... Um, an older Zimmerman dress, but it's just stunning. It's a maxi and it has buttons that go all the way down. I do think I need to try this one on because it's been a while since I've worn it. And this one is the same print, of course, but it is shorter and it has some tiers with uh, some little scalloped details. It's very, very cute. I do remember this one being a bit small in the chest, so I do want to try this one on. This one is also from Waif, and I do remember the chest being a little bit too small, so I'm going to try this one on as well. This is from Cece, and it's a little off-the-shoulder maxi dress. It's really 
really beautiful, really comfortable to wear. I will definitely keep this one. This is an older one from Zara and I have worn this into oblivion. I still love it so much. I feel like this is very much a Lizzie dress. This is like me as a dress. I just, I love the floral print so much. It's so soft and romantic and I don't think I can part with it just yet. This one is from Sister Jane and it is so beautiful. It's really flowy and a little bit oversized and it has these really gorgeous details on it. I wore this one to um, an event for my hometown. We have like this really big thing called Oil Dorado and I was in a beauty pageant a um, long long time ago so they had like a luncheon for the queens and I wore this and I cannot tell you how many compliments I got everyone loved it as much as I did. This one is from Chicwish and I think it's a really cute dress especially for spring and summer. I do think that I'm going to try this one on and more than likely move it to the master closet because I have a lot of dresses up here so I just want to keep like the most special ones. And this one is special but I, I do want to have some more room on here. This is from Sleeper, and I got it off of Poshmark during the fall, so I haven't worn it yet, but I thought it would be a really nice everyday dress for the springtime. This is my strawberry dress, and this is honestly like everywhere <laughs> a couple years ago. I still love it. I think it's very much my style, super girly, feminine, and whimsical. This is from Show Me Your Moo Moo from last year. It's a really beautiful maxi dress with pink and white stripes. I thought it was adorable, very much my style, um, perfect for vacation or every day. This is from Chicwish, and this dress is honestly so so pretty. The color is absolutely gorgeous and the entire dress is lace. It's also incredibly flattering. This is from Amy Jane London. She makes a lot of really cute girly dresses. I absolutely love this. There's tulle all the way down and a lace bodice, some little puff sleeves, and a little, uh, what is this called? <laughs> a corset back with um, ribbon. Very, very cute. Definitely a princess dress. This is from Chicwish, and I absolutely love this dress. I've worn it so many times. I think it's very much my style. It has uh, like a big vintage style collar, lots of ruffles, a rose print, and it's really easy to wear. I do think I'm going to move this to my normal closet because I wear it a lot and so I think that it um, probably belongs more so in there. This is from Waif and this is, um, well you can wear it up here or off the shoulder but it's this really beautiful pink floral dress with some daisies. It's maxi and it is very pretty and very flattering and I just love it. This is from Red Dress. I absolutely love the shape of it. It's so beautiful and so flattering. It's just gorgeous. It's a really pretty pink color with some white embroidered flowers and puff sleeves. This is from Sister Jane and it's probably my most worn Sister Jane dress. It's really easy to wear. It's very simple. It's just like a really beautiful light pink color and it has bows on the sleeves. I love taking this one with me when I travel or when I'm out and about because it's just really easy to wear and super comfy. This is also Sister Jane and it is really beautiful. It's this gorgeous pale pink pink like satiny silky fabric um, with some black details. You have bows down the front and then a really interesting collar. I actually wore this one for dinner in Palm Desert and it was a hit. This is also from Sister Jane and this is my princess dress. <laughs> so it is um, a maxi length and it is very voluminous both in the sleeves and the skirt. It is just really beautiful. Every time I wear this, I get so many compliments. Um, but I did wear it for some Christmas pictures and then I also wore it for my blog anniversary photos last year. The only thing I don't like about it is that the top is actually like see-through, so I always wear a cami underneath. But other than that, it is pretty close to perfect. This is from Chicwish and it's another beautiful princessy dress. So this is completely see-through. You do have to have like a slip underneath, which is no problem. The bow actually goes in the back and then there's a lot of like tulle ruffles. It's just very, very pretty. 
This is also from Chicwish, and this is a really pretty, like, everyday floral dress. It has puff sleeves, and there's also some little pearl details. Um, I do wear this one a lot, just, like, day to day, so I think I might move this one over to the other closet. In fact, most of, like, the more casual dresses I'll probably move over there. This is from Morning Lavender, and I've had this dress forever. <laughs> it's a really beautiful apricot color. It's fully lace. It does have kind of, like, a crop top with an invisible waistline. It's really pretty. However, the last time I tried it on, it was a bit small up here, so I think this is another one that I need to try on again. This is another favorite from Chicwish, and I have worn this one into the ground. There is a little hole here that I need to fix, and yeah, it's just getting kind of worn out. Um, so I'm going to fix that, and I'm going to move this one to the everyday closet because this is more of just kind of like a throw-on dress. This is from Tahari ASL, and again, I don't typically do light yellow, but this dress is just, I just love it so much. I feel like it's very, like, 1950s housewife. It's really, really beautiful. Love the floral print and love the flutter sleeves. This is from Chi Chi London, and I absolutely love the cream color, and I love the florals and the little buttons and the puff sleeves. This is... Um, kind of like an everyday princess type dress. It's very pretty and very feminine. This is from Chicwish and it has so many beautiful ruffle details at the top and the skirt is super flowy. The fabric is really nice and breezy. I feel like this would be a really great vacation dress. I do need to try it on because it's been a while since I've worn it. This is from Elliot, and I absolutely love this dress. I think it is so cute, so feminine, very flattering. It's a very easy to wear um, day to day dress, and I love the floral pattern. This is also from Elliot, and this was actually one of the dresses that I wore to my very first fashion week. So I actually did wear this one to fashion week as well, but this one was to my very first one. So it has a lot of sentimental meaning to me. It's something that I never thought I would get to experience, and I'm getting like teary eyed just thinking about it. But um, yeah, this dress just means so much to me, and it is so, so beautiful. It is my ideal dress. There's so many like ruffles and the floral is just absolutely beautiful. It does have kind of like a halter detail with um, some sleeves that come down off the shoulder. It's a really pretty dress. This is one that I got from a boutique. I'm not sure of the brand, but I think it is so beautiful. The details are just absolutely stunning. There are tiers that go all the way down on the skirt, and I really love the top. It has ah! <laughs> it has a vintage look that I just love. This is from Waif, and this is a lace maxi dress. It's very pretty. It goes off the shoulder like that. I think this would be really great for the beach or even as part of like a boho look. It's very, very pretty. And this is a fancier dress from Waif. It's also lace and maxi length. It's very pretty. It has like a plunging neckline, which I don't typically wear plunging necklines, but I think this is just so, so pretty and so flattering and really elegant. I feel like this would be a nice, like, fancy dinner dress. This is from River Island. Last year, this sage green color was super popular, and I loved it. I still love it. I love this gingham print. It's very much like Southern Belle, <laughs> which I feel like is kind of like my style in a way, um, but it's really cute. It's a maxi length that has puff sleeves. The fabric is like really comfy. It's almost a knit, but yeah, really, really cute. This is from Sister Jane, and I think that this is actually my very first dress from Sister Jane. It is so beautiful. I love the white with the blue florals. It's absolutely stunning. It is a maxi length, and it has puff sleeves, and just like really beautiful details. In fact, it's very similar to the dress I'm wearing. The neckline is the same, and it has puff sleeves, and then it has this little roost area. 
<laughs> so yeah, definitely going to keep this one. This is from Selkie, and you might be surprised to know that this is my only Selkie dress. <laughs> so um, I got this one on major sale. I thought it was absolutely beautiful. I wore it for photos. I haven't worn it out yet, but it is really, really pretty. So it's kind of like like a high low hem very very pretty very glamorous and I love the rose print the color is kind of like a light blue gray it also has some ruffles along the neckline it's very pretty this is from waif I really love the color I love the florals it does still have the tag on it um, so I think that I need to try this one on because it's been a while this is also from the Love Shack Fancy Target collaboration. So I actually got this one secondhand because these sold out so quickly. I couldn't even get my hands on it. And I just, I love it so much. I think the color is absolutely beautiful. I love the floral print. It is very much a princess dress. And this is actually the dress that I'm wearing in my profile picture, but I just changed it to pink, but this is the one. <laughs> this is from Chicwish and I absolutely adore this dress. It is maxi. Most of these are maxi, <laughs> but it has this beautiful eyelet lace across the whole dress and a really cute little ruffle detail. Um, it's just very pretty, very like vintage inspired. It's a really cute dress. This is also from Chicwish and it has a really beautiful like vintage vibe to it. It has buttons and embroidery and a beautiful square neckline with some uh, lace. This one I got, I want to say it was fall of last year, so I haven't really gotten to wear it yet because it got cold really fast, but I'm excited to wear this more for spring. This is from River Island, and it is the same dress as this green one. <laughs> it's just in blue, so the same gingham print, and it's also maxi. You've got puff sleeves. It's really, really cute. I wore this to um, Carmel by the Sea last year. It's a really nice, comfy dress just to wear day to day when you're out and about. This dress is from ASOS, and this is another really special one. I think this is one of the prettiest dresses that I own. I wore this to my very first New York Fashion Week and I got photographed and was everywhere. So yeah, this is a very special dress. I think it is so beautiful. It has an open back. It's just really, really dreamy and romantic. This is from Ellie Tahari and I got it last year. I love it so much. I wore it so much. I wore it to the flower fields. I wore it everywhere. <laughs> but it's this really gorgeous light blue color and the whole thing is just lace. It is really stunning, has like a cottagecore vibe, and I just absolutely love it. This is from Review Australia, and if you saw my coat video, then you know that I have a lot of their coats. They have a lot of really beautiful vintage-inspired items, and yeah, they're very, very feminine. I fell in love with the daisy print. I thought it was super cute. I love the fit. There's a little bow in the back. It's really beautiful and flattering. This one is from And Other Stories. I also have it in gray. <laughs> but this is one of my favorite dresses to wear. It's so comfy, so easy to wear. Um, great for every day, great for like, you know, when you're going places. It's just one of those really comfy, cozy dresses. I got this at a Rent the Runway sample sale in New York when I was there for Fashion Week one year. I absolutely love the lavender color, love the floral print. It is very, very pretty, very feminine. It has ruffles down here. Um, the last time I tried it on, it was a little too small up here. So I am going to try this one on again to see how it fits. This is from Review, and this is one of my favorite review pieces of all time. I love this dress. The color is so beautiful. I love the florals. It has these beautiful like magenta and purple florals with some blue in there. It's so, so twirly. Oh my goodness. And there's little bows on the sleeves. I wore this to Palm Springs. Um, I've worn it actually a lot of places. <laughs> it's just really easy to wear and really pretty. So here's what I got so far. These are just dresses that I'll be trying on. More than likely I won't be getting rid of them, um, but I guess this just makes me feel better about myself. So let's go ahead and move into the master closet. And now I'm in the bedroom, so the lighting is a little bit different, so sorry if it looks <laughs> different. And then also for some reason it's kind of echoey, so I just 
open to this door. Hopefully that helps. Okay, so this first one is also from Sister Jane. It's a beautiful cream color and it has this stunning floral print. It does have a slightly open back with a bow. I wore this one for Christmas and everyone loved it. It is so, so pretty. This is the gray version of the blue dress that I shared in there. It has gray with pink and purple and blue. It's really, really pretty, very easy to wear. And this is from Chicwish. This is a great everyday dress. It's a maxi. It has puff sleeves. It's very like cottage core. <laughs> I love this one. This one is from Free People and I got it a long time ago. A lot of people ask me about this dress. I've worn it so many places including to the flower fields. It's just very, very pretty. It has kind of like a little patchwork look with a lot of different lace and Swiss dots. It's very, very, very pretty. This one is from Chicwish and it was in my Valentine's Day haul. It's so beautiful. It has this gorgeous like satiny material. It's a gorgeous like purple color and there's buttons that go all the way down. It's very pretty. This one was also from my haul and it's really gorgeous. I don't typically wear a lot of red, but I did like the deep burgundy and it has these stunning black velvet flowers all over it. And this is also from Chicwish. It has a shimmery knit on top and a tulle skirt. It is a maxi and this was also in my haul. The sleeves are a little large on me so I do need to tailor those so I'm going to put this in a separate pile to take care of that. This is a wrap dress and it has this beautiful silky satin material. It's a true black and there's pearl details all along the neckline. It's really pretty. My husband really likes this one and I think it is really elegant. All right, now I'm starting in the closet and these are my sleeveless dresses. The first one is from Cece and this is a really cute ship style which I don't typically wear because my shape is um it's more of like a pear shape or hourglass I don't really know but I have hips so I don't typically go for this but I do really like this one I think it's cute with blazers there's some ruffle details and lace it's very very pretty and this is from Chic Wish it's a cute little like tweed dress I love the lace details it also has these black bows it's a super cute dress it's very Chanel-esque this is from Harper Rose and it's a really cute polka dot dress. It's very, very twirly. There's a little black bow. I think it's adorable. I think this is perfect for summertime. This is also from Harper Rose and it's a cream color with black polka dots and there's also a little bit of gold shimmer in there as well. It's tweed and it has a really interesting neckline. It's actually very flattering on and I really, really love this one. This is from Chi Chi and it is so cute. So it's very long and it does have like a high low hem. I absolutely love this dress. The floral is so pretty, love the colors and I love the styling. This is from a brand called Endless Rose and it is a newer addition to my closet. I love the pink color, it's adorable. This is tweed and there are buttons all the way down and actually that is what I don't like about it. I do wish that it was just buttoned and had a zipper on the side because every single time you get in it you do have to button and unbutton and there a little tough but it is very cute so sometimes it's worth it for fashion I guess. <laughs> this is from Blank London and it is very cute. It has two shades of pink and then some gold details. I love pairing this one with a white top underneath. It looks very very cute. This is from Chicwish and I love the roses. It's super super cute. The background is like a yellowy cream color. It's very pretty. I love pairing this one with a cardigan or with a top underneath. In fact, all of these look really cute um, paired in those two ways. This is from Review and the pattern is very, very cute. I don't typically go for navy, but I do really love this one. I think the flowers are absolutely stunning and I love this little like ruffle detail on the sleeve. This is from Eliza J and this dress is so, so beautiful. <laughs> so interesting story. I wore this to Fashion Week. It may have 
been, no, it wasn't my first one. I think it was my second one. So I wore this to, um, you know, the shows and to an event and I got photographed and, um, got so much press over it. But on the way back to where we were staying, I took the subway and I ran into the designer of this dress. She stopped me and we started talking. It was like the most incredible moment. It was it was just absolutely crazy. So this dress, it's really, really pretty, but it also has a lot of sentimental meaning to it. And I love that it has a really cool story to go with it too. This is also Eliza J and this is a so beautiful. It's navy and it has these little specks of pink and white. And then at the bottom, it has a little ruffle hemline. It's very, very cute. I love this one. This is one of my very favorites from Review. It is so cute. And actually the lilac review coat that I shared in my last declutter video, I got it specifically to wear with this dress because they are the same shade of lilac. It's really cute. It's very like Southern Belle. Such an adorable dress. This is from Chicwish and this is one of my favorite sleeveless dresses. It is so pretty. It looks like a princess dress. It has this gorgeous brocade and it's just really, really stunning. The color is like a light blush pink, almost lilac color. It is very, very elegant, very princessy. <laughs> This is also from Chicwish, and I have to say that when it comes to the style, they really do it well. Um, they have a lot of really beautiful sleeveless dresses and even skirts with this type of fabric and pattern, and they're always so beautiful. I really love the colors on this one. It's very similar to this one, but I think it is different enough to stand out. This is also another favorite from Review Australia and one of my favorite sleeveless dresses. I've worn this one so much. I just love it. Uh, it is a beautiful purple tweed and there is some hot pink and blue in there as well. There's little buttons down here and I love these, this detail. Sorry, the door keeps closing. <laughs> but I love this detail along the neckline. It has a very like vintage look and I don't typically go for dresses like this that are a little closer to the body but it is very, very flattering and it fits perfect. And this is another from CC, and it is the same dress as this, but just in a different fabric. So this one has a really gorgeous, like, black mesh overlay with some beautiful red and pink embroidered flowers. It's very, very pretty. And now we're moving on to short sleeve dresses. So we'll start with this one from Peace Bird. So I did a Peace Bird review and haul quite a while ago, um, but there's a lot of really cute dresses in there. I don't know if they still sell to the US. I know things had changed after that video, but it's worth checking out. So this one is super cute. It has like a vintage look. It is a true white. There's embroidered florals. There's a really fun collar and puff sleeves. It's really cute. This one is also from Peace Bird. It's white with a floral pattern and it is super flattering. So it has a slight puff sleeve and a v-neck and it looks really, really pretty on. This is another cute dress from Peace Bird. It's white with some blue embroidered stars. It has a really fun vintage collar and a little bow and then a little puff sleeve. It's super, super cute. I love this dress. It's almost like a baby doll style. This is also from them, <laughs> and this is a little sailor dress. I thought it was adorable because my brother um, is currently deployed. He's in the Navy, and I miss him very much, but um, I got this for him, <laughs> and so I thought it was really, really cute, and this also comes off, so it's just like a plain white dress that can be styled with anything. And this is also from them. I absolutely loved this. I thought it was adorable. So it has this really pretty light organza fabric, puff sleeves, uh, a little ruffle at the bottom, some embroidered designs. I think they're like abstract florals. <laughs> and then a large bow. This is from Chicwish, and for some reason, this reminds me of like Grace Kelly. <laughs> it's very cute. It's like a vintage inspired dress with a sweetheart neckline. There's some tulle at the front, and it's just a really cute, elegant dress. 
This is from Free People and I got it off of Poshmark years ago before I started my blog. It is so, so beautiful and romantic. It has a fully lace top, some lace panels down the front and back, and then there's some cream chiffon and a lot of really beautiful ruffle details. The hemline is actually kind of like a zigzag. It's really, really pretty. However, I haven't worn this one in a while. Um, more than likely, I'm going to keep it because I do still think it is very much my style, but I do want to try it on. This is from Chicwish, and this is one of my favorites for vacation. I do wear it like for everyday life too, but I think that it's perfect for that. It's really comfy, and it's just really cute, and I love all of these tassels and the embroidery as well. This is from Zara and it's quite old. I got it in Paris whenever I went with my husband. It was um, our first and only time together, so it is really special. I do really love this one and I used to wear it a lot, but it's been a while since I've uh, worn it, so I do want to try it on. Um, I will be keeping it though because it is very sentimental and I am that type of person, but I do want to try it on and just see how it looks. This is from Waif, and this is a wraparound dress. It's really cute for the summertime. Um, it is like a cream color with embroidered black polka dots. It's really fun and easy to wear. This one is from LuLaRoe. <laughs> And I do still have a few dresses. I'm not sure where they are because they're not here. They must be in the garage. But I do have a few of the Amelia dresses left. And if you didn't know, I used to be a LuLaRoe consultant. That's what it was called back then, whenever literally like they first started or first went viral, I guess. Um, but yeah, I did two videos about my experience. They're worth watching if that's something that you are into. Um, I will leave those linked below if you are interested. But yeah, I do still really like this dress. It's really comfy, really easy to wear, and I think it's cute. This is also an oldie from Free People. I got this off of Poshmark, and literally, this is still one of my favorite dresses. It is so twirly and so beautiful. It's just absolutely Absolutely gorgeous. It has been a while since I have worn it because I did gain a little bit of weight but then I lost a little bit so <laughs> I do want to try it on and see if it fits. This is from Kate Spade and it is absolutely gorgeous. It's this beautiful like pink floral chiffon fabric with some ruffles along uh, the chest area and the sleeves is very very pretty so I never do this but I actually bought this when it was a tad too small and I have lost weight since then so I do want to try it on and see if it fits it was on major sale and it was one of those dresses that I just couldn't live without and I still love it it is probably one of my favorite dresses in my entire dress wardrobe so fingers crossed this is a really pretty dress from Waif. It's a light pink color with some black polka dots. It kind of goes down like in at the hips and then flares out with this really pretty ruffle. The um, neckline goes down in the V and there's ruffles. I really love this one and it was really flattering on me. It's been a while since I've worn it so I do want to try this one on as well. This is from And Other Stories <laughs> and I thought it was so cute. It has an open back and I just love the pink color and the puff sleeves. I love a good puff sleeve if you couldn't tell. And the length is really, really cute. Um, I did get this during the fall so I haven't got to wear it yet but I absolutely love it. This is from Sister Jane and this is another Poshmark find, brand new, <laughs> and I just thought it was so, so pretty. I did get it in the fall so I haven't had a chance to wear it yet, maybe for my birthday, we'll see, but I love the embroidered flowers and the color and the length. It's more of like like a little cupcake dress. It's very, very cute. This is from Chicwish, and this is one of my all-time favorite dresses from them. So this is a really beautiful, like, apricot peach color. There is some really gorgeous floral detailing on the sleeve and on the hemline. It's been a while since I've worn this one, so I do want to try it on again. This is from Adriana Papel, and oh my goodness, this dress is so so beautiful. When I saw it, I was like, I need that. 
So it has kind of like a vintage look, at least to me. Um, it reminds me of like the Pan Am you know, uniforms, like a little bit, I don't know. But it is a more fitted silhouette. It's very, very flattering. It has a ruffled hemline and a little bow at the neck. This is the same dress as this, <laughs> but it's in uh, blue. So it's in a beautiful light blue with a white star embroidery. It has a really adorable collar and then, you know, a little bow at the front. It is super, super cute. This is from Review, and this is the same design as the Daisy dress that I shared in um, my closet room, but this one is in a navy polka dot. It's very, very twirly. There's a little bow. It's very vintage looking. I just love it so much. This is from Eliza J, and this dress is so beautiful. <laughs> so it is navy with pink florals, and there is a little bit of gold in there for some shimmer. I do love the look of it, and there's some ruffles as well. I do remember it being a little tight in the hips, so um, I don't reach for it that often. I, I think I need to try this one on as well. This is from CC. This is a super cute shift style navy with some floral embroidery and a really cute little collar. This is a really, really adorable dress. This is an older one from Anthropology, and I got it probably right before I started my blog, maybe a little bit after. It was my favorite favorite dress of all time and it still is up there. I think it is still very much my style. It's very feminine and beautiful. I love the floral details on the front and on the sleeves and on the hemline and the lilac color is gorgeous. I do want to try this one on though because um, I do remember it being a little bit small the last time I tried it on but um, yeah, hopefully it fits. This is from Chicwish, and I think it is adorable. It's very like princessy. <laughs> it has a lot of ruching and some puff sleeves and some details along the neck. So this one, I really do love it, but the ruching on the hips is not that flattering for me, uh, just because I do have larger hips and I think it draws more attention to them. So I'm going to try this one on and see how it looks. This is another old favorite from Free People, also found on Poshmark, and it is the lilac version of the cream one I shared earlier. It's very pretty, very twirly. It's very feminine, but it does have a boho vibe. This is another one that I do want to try on because it has been a while since I've worn it. This is from Chicwish, and it is the gray version of the apricot peach dress that I shared earlier. Um, it has the same design with the beautiful floral work. It's just really, really pretty. I wore this one to Europe whenever we went, and oh my gosh, it's like a really pretty dress, but it's also very comfortable, so it's a great everyday dress. I do want to try it on, though, because it has been a while since I've worn it. This is a newer one from CC. I believe I got it in the fall, and it is really, really cute. It's very Blair Waldorf Academia vibes. <laughs> so it has this really pretty um, plaid print, and sparkly buttons and a really cute little collar. It is more of like a form-fitting dress, but it is very flattering and it's really cute. This is from Adriana Papel and it looks really pretty on the hanger, but I actually feel like this is a dress that looks better on. It is so flattering and beautiful. It's a black and white and it has um, a mix of lace and floral embroidery. It's very, very pretty. This is another one from Zara and I got it when we were in Paris during our trip and I asked I actually saw a girl wearing this when we were walking down the street and I was like, oh my gosh, I love that dress. And then when I went to Zara, I found it and had to have it. It is really, really pretty. It has these gorgeous florals and some sequins. It has been a while since I've worn this one, so I do want to try it on. This is another one from Peace Bird, and it is a true black with some little tiny pink embroidered flowers. I think it is adorable. There's also some buttons on here. It's very, very cute. And actually, I almost wonder if you can like unbutton this and make it like an off the shoulder. I'll have to try that. But yeah, I love this one. I actually don't remember where I got this one, but it is really, really pretty. This is my little black dress. <laughs> it's completely lace and it is just absolutely 
absolutely beautiful. Okay, so this video ended up being a lot longer than I thought it would be, so I'm gonna go ahead and break it up into two parts. So I'm going to end part one right here, and so far I hope that you're really liking it. Um, are you also a dress lover? Are you doing any decluttering of your own? Be sure to leave a comment down below. Also, if you like what you see so far, make sure to leave a thumbs up and don't forget to share and subscribe. I post content like this all the time, lots of frilly feminine fashion <laughs> and lifestyle content. Um, I think you might really like it. And be sure to check out my blog, lizzieandlace.com and my pretty pink Instagram at lizzieandlace. I will see you next time for part two. See you later. Bye.